one of those days. If you can avoid being outdoors, you just stay inside as much as possible. But for a lot of people, making a living requires being outside even in this blistering heat. NBC 4's Courtney Yoon joins us now at Sayotamal Fountain with tips on how you can try to stay cool. Courtney? Well, Mike, everyone's trying to find a way to stay cool. And if you take a look here, kids and families are doing that just that here at the Sayota Mile Fountain. But for employees of a food truck, there's no place to escape the heat. It's just sweltering. I, I don't have another word to describe it. Welcome to Timmy's Meltdown. That isn't exactly where the name came from, but it definitely applies. <laughs> Joan Bowman is the truck's grill master. She keeps a positive attitude despite working for hours over a burning hot flat top. You have to give yourself something to hope for, so like not being in the direct sun. In the wintertime, standing over the grill is a coveted spot. It looks like it is boiling hot. A grill, they got flamed, and it's 95 degrees or whatever it is. But Bowman definitely deserves it after seeing what she endures during the summer. Grills at 350, um, so it's uh, easily 100, 150 probably where, right where Joni's at. Wow. So for a couple of hours, it's pretty tough. The staff at Timmy's drink plenty of water and keep cold rags nearby for relief. Franklin County Public Health says use a fan to circulate the air on hot days. Don't wait until you're thirsty to drink water and stay in the shade as much as possible. There's like warm and then there's sort of hot and it's almost hot and then there's hot and then it's pretty hot and very hot. And Today is uh, approaching stupid hot. During a lunch rush, Timmy's turns out 50 to 100 grilled cheese sandwiches, and they enjoy their work no matter how hot and humid it gets. People seem to like our food and actually have customers come back once in a while. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Have a good day, too. Even on hot days, we do, we do pretty well. On sweltering hot days like this, look out for young children and the elderly who may be living alone. If you can, try to wear lightweight, light-colored cotton clothing if possible. Local for you in Columbus, Courtney Yoon, NBC4. Alrighty, thanks so much, Courtney. We appreciate that. Keeping track of these scorching temperatures by downloading the free Storm Team 4 weather app. Just search NBC4WX and take the most accurate forecast with you while you are on the go.